I am going to do one final project with my house. Now, if we rotate up and look, we can see that my house is solid on the inside. Most houses aren't solid on the inside. They have rooms in them. So we are going to actually cut into and make the inside of our house hollow. The best way to do that is with a shape that we turn into a hole. All the way back at the beginning of this project, we made our original block that is the main part of our house. We need to make another block about the same size. So we're going to pull open shapes pane and bring over a box. Our original box was 20 long by 50 wide by 30 high. We want our new box to be not quite as long, not quite as wide, and not quite as high. So instead of making it 20 long, let's make it 16 long. So I'm going to click here and I can actually type in 16 and hit return. It was 50 wide Let's make it 50, I'm sorry, 44 wide. And it was 30 high, so let's make it 26 high. Now we have a shape that is slightly smaller than our house. Now to cut into the inside of our house, we need to make our shape into a hole. So we're going to come over here and click on hole. And now we have to move this hole into our house. So I'm going to position it about where it looks like it's in our house. And we're going to use our rotation to move that hole into our house. I'm going to use my arrow keys so I can move this shape precisely. Here's the trick. The best way to see where our hole is in our house is to actually rotate it and look at it from below. We want our hole aligned on the bottom of our house. Let's use that align tool again by clicking on both shapes. Clicking a line and then centering those two shapes together. I'm feeling pretty good about this. I'm going to group them. And now if I rotate back up again, you will see that I have a house that I can see through and that has a hollow interior. Congratulations on building your house.